have serious, I'm so angry. Oh my God, I feel like I'm shaking with anger. So today has been a huge errand day. I woke up really, really early and dropped Harrison at nursery. I went to the bank for an appointment. I went and got my nails done. I am now sat down editing. I've got all my work stuff ready for tomorrow because I go back to work tomorrow for a whole day. So I'm gonna leave it a couple more hours, I think, edit this video and try and get that up. And then go and pick up Harrison. Um, Mike's out this evening, so I need to have one of them nights where I get Harrison into bed pretty, as early as possible anyway, so that I can get into bed myself and just have a nice night's sleep ready for my early start tomorrow. I might take Harrison to the park just to double make sure that he's worn out and obviously just to spend some time with him. But for my nails I went for OPI's Mod About You which actually I quite like. That. <coughs> quack? It's not a quack is it? It's a caterpillar butterfly. You shame Harrison. Hold on. Biscuit? You want me to bake in it? <laughs> Let's break it in half. Okay, that's enough. In your eye. <laughs> That's a funny noise. You put another two. Twelve teeth. Twelve teeth. You're brushing your teeth. Ah, oh, you're brushing your teeth, you clever boy. Should we go and brush them properly? Should we go and brush them properly? Good boy. Good boy. Are you brushing it with your finger? You're going to get your toothbrush. Oh. You're going to shy. What are you playing with? Uh oh. Ta? Can I have it, please? Ta? Teeth anymore, they're done. Come on! <coughs> no, out of mummy's cupboard. <coughs> so, Harrison has just had a crazy, crazy meltdown over. I don't even know what he just melted down, but he's fallen asleep. So lunchtime is going to be put back a little bit. So he's going out, but hopefully he wakes up in a better mood. Also, I know I spoke about toys before, but how many times on average do you think the normal mum or dad packs away the toys in a day? Because I feel like that's all I do. Right, so it is 12.55 and Harrison is still napping, but he's been asleep for like... 45 minutes I'm thinking do I push my luck and put the kettle on putting the kettle on is probably going to wake him up because that's just my luck I think I'm going to go for it 
so the kettle is on and I do feel like I'm kind of breaking the law I feel like these kids hear everything and having a cup of tea is like hold on mum you're not allowed tea that's like a big no-no for them so far so good hello <coughs> mummy was just about to have a cup of tea did you smell it there's no need for tears there's no need for tears is there hey look you'll be such a good big boy is that nice pumpkin pasta would you like mummy's help? Yeah. No? Okay. Good boy. We are out of the house. Yes. I have serious, I'm so angry. Oh my god, I feel like I'm shaking with anger over the most pathetic reason in the whole world. I'm, I'm so annoyed. A lady, obviously I don't know her circumstances or any of her background, but she looks very able-bodied perfectly fine in my opinion is in a baby space when there's parking which I'm in now but very far away from the shops I've got a baby with me I need the space to get him out of the car into the push chair and she's in that space Rage. I got out of the car and I said excuse me excuse me you're in a baby space and she said I know curious right now I know that just because you have a baby doesn't mean you have any right to any superior treatment and blah 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 but baby spaces are so so much more helpful yeah. and they're there for a reason like I, before I had Harrison I know I was like oh why do they need their own space but honestly guys it really helps they're more spacious and they're closer to the shops and I'm furious that because she wanted to go to bloody Wallis yeah. Oh my god, and just the attitude. I'm back in the car now. We've done a little shop. Harrison's melted down the whole way round. Still melting down now, but I feel better. It's one of those days, I think. Everybody that's rude is out and about, but maybe it's me. <laughs> I don't know. I've bought Harrison loads of toys because I felt bad for melting down and being cross in front of him. And now I think I might go and get a drive through and head to my mum's for a cup of much needed tea. I finished my tea earlier. Thumbs up for that. Um, but I need another one now. Harrison, where's your other shoe? Yeah. yeah, you've got one on. Where's the other one? Where's your other shoe? Yeah. We've lost a shoe. Be our new little friend. Finally! 